Okay, on the Chalupa lovers, welcome to Splayer Got Tasso at get Reese Nelson, the 17 year old right mid who says had a 59 overall. So, three star skill moves and three star weak foot. We'll take a look at those physical and mental stats here. So, 84 acceleration, 79 sprint speed, 84 agility, 65 balance, 46 jumping, a very low 35 stamina from a start mentally, 44 reaction, 57 composure, and attack position. Now, getting into the technical stats. 64 ball control, 50 crossing, 74 dribbling is actually very good considering his overall 53 fin finishing, but a very low 41 long pass and 44 short pass. Definitely need some improvements in those stats, uh, but you can take a look at that vision also. So 51 vision and 44 strength there, and you can see the penalties are at the 54 mark for those three stats that are unfortunately emitted from a squad hub. So 5 foot 9, uh, right footed, high medium work rates, 3 star weak foot, and 3 star skimmos. We'll take a look at that growth here at that f end of that first season. So a plus 5, 2 is over up to the 64, plus 1 in the pace, plus 2 uh, Jody jumping and stamina. Technically, a big plus 8 to the ball control, dribbling, crossing, and finishing up by 6, and a plus 8 to the long pass, and a plus 7 to the short pass. So you see kind of just throughout this video, the ball control, crossing, dribbling, finishing, passing, will be, will be getting, kind of getting the majority of the growth in those technical stats. And uh, you can see again there, plus 11 to the finishing, standing out, plus 8 ball control, so plus 7 crossing, dribbling up to the 85 mark as well. is actually really good uh, considering his overall. So up to the 71 overall at age 20. Plus one acceleration, plus three sprint speed. Uh, stamina has actually been growing uh, fairly steadily throughout this video also. And technically, big plus ten to the long pass, uh, finishing up by seven. Good improvements to the ball control, crossing, dribbling there also. 74 overall at age 21. Uh, some pretty solid growth there. You can see physically uh, sprint speed up by three, agility up by one. A little bit more improvement to the balance, jumping, and stamina there is nice to see as well. And technically, those key stats continue to improve also. So uh, he's actually grown fairly quickly, uh, but at just about this point or so, he's going to start to kind of sputter with his growth, unfortunately. Not sure why that was. I mean, he was playing consistently, uh, but I think may have to do with his form and morale, despite this, the fact he was starting and everything, but it's very strange as it just hasn't happened too much, really, uh, some of the sputtered growth I saw uh, with him uh, in these last few seasons, you'll see, so age 24, sending on overall, good improvement though to that pace, and technically, you can see 97 ball control, 95 dribbling, uh, finishing also in the 90s there as well, so 82 overall at age 26 now, uh, and the sprint speed up to the 92 mark, 90 agility, has maxed out in the dribbling, 98 ball control, 91 finishing, long pass has got up to the 75 mark, and the 69 short pass there as well, so you can see him, some of these highlights, very quick turn, obviously pretty agile, a very nice finish from here in that little uh, tight space, I did actually play him a bit as a striker, because he had that high finishing, uh, and also did play him as a winger, Cam, I mean, he can make things happen, just not have the best passing, so I do prefer him as a winger or just as a just more direct type of striker, running at the defense and utilizing his agility and pace in those tight spaces. Good job in that build-up you can see in that play also. And this time again, a quick little turn, very rapid, and creating an own goal basically. I just rifled it in and actually hit off of the keeper after he saved it. So we'll take that, obviously. As you can see, doing a good job here, creating a goal also, taking efforts. Fortunately, didn't get the finish, but still, you can see the build he has in those tight spaces. Very solid. And again, running at the defense now. Quick cuts. Felt really good on the ball when he hit that potential. And taking a very good effort. Just saved. Very good save, actually, from the keeper right there. Prevent him from scoring. But now again, on this wing, running at the defense, you can see that pace coming into play. And of course, grew quite a bit. And cutting the ball back for a very nice assist there. So again, doesn't have the best passing but can occasionally find some brilliance from time to time. I see him doing a good job again, cutting in, playing a good pass to set up and grab himself another assist there. So really did enjoy using him. Uh, but I do think training is probably the way to go because it took a, get a good 10 seasons, I believe, to hit his potential. So you're most likely going to want to train him unless you want, you're playing a super long career mode because uh, it took a while, I believe it's 10 seasons or so. As you can see, him hitting his potential here, 83 overall at age 27. And we'll take a look at those uh, stats here individually again. So physically, 99 acceleration, 94 sprint speed, 90 agility, 68 balance, 52 jumping, 58 stamina, much better than it was at the start.
start at least 50 reactions, 63 composure, 64 attack position, so not much growth there mentally, unfortunately, but technically maxed out ball control, 83 crossing, maxed out dribbling, 92 finishing, 76 long pass, 71 short pass, 70 shot power, 62 long shots, 58 volleys, and 67 curves. So we'll take a look here at these calculations at other positions. So 77 as a striker, 85 as a winger, uh, 81 as a center forward, 80 as a kim. Uh, then you can see again, obviously, 83 is a right mid-left mid. So very effective as a winger, and he play a bit centrally for you also if needed. Just doesn't have the best passing, which kind of straightened me away from playing him. There's a 64 vision and 53 strength there also, and the penalties did reach the 69 mark. So you can take a look at that playing formation again. 5 foot 9, right foot high medium work rates, 3 star weak foots, and 3 star skin was end up obtaining the speedster and acrobat specialties. So turns into a very solid player just took him obviously quite a long time to hit that potential so plus 23 of the crossing plus 39 finishing uh, short passing up by 27 dribbling up by 25 plus 35 to long pass along with the ball control so some good improvements there uh, in the pace plus 15 to the pace in general really acceleration and sprint speed uh, Jody reactions up by six balance up by three it comes to the power stats stamina did go up to point go up by 23 which is very good uh, strength up by nine long shots up by 20 and mentally uh, just unfortunately just a plus 7 to the, the positioning plus 13 vision plus 15 penalties though plus 6 composure you can see defending marking up by 18 plus 12 stand tackle and a plus 9 to the slide tackle there so again it took about 10 seasons to hit his potential so you're going to want to have to train you're going to want to train him again unless you're going to play a very long career mode I know some people do that but obviously uh, if, I think he'd be ideal for Road to Glory style career mode train him up Get those technical stats up, especially that passing. I said it's actually quite awful from the start. You want to utilize probably the uh, beat your man Drew as well as so you can get that agility dribbling as well as stamina up also. But with that, guys, thank you for tuning in. My beautiful Chulipa lovers did turn into a very good attacking player. Liked him as a striker and winger. Uh, and, of course, shows he can play camera center forward. Probably not ideal considering his pretty average passing he ends up with. But that, guys, thank you for tuning in, my beautiful Chalupa lovers. I love you. I'll be signing out now, and I'll catch you guys later.